East Baton Rouge for a minute here. You got a local nonprofit, does a lot of good, just wrapping up a great summer youth program. This one specifically helping middle and high school students. It takes a village, and the yeah, Gardier sure. Initiative involves multiple agencies and volunteers mm -hmm. to make their mission possible. So this morning, Matt Venezia is live with the great hands and hearts involved. Hey, Matt, good morning. Hey Liz, that's right. There's a lot of great hands that have been involved with helping Gardier Initiative just with this program, the Summer of Youth program that just wrapped up over the course of an eight-week stretch. And a big reason for that is right here, Mr. Chad Parker over with Community Policing of the East Baton Rouge Sheriff's Office. Can you describe the relationship that you all have over at the Sheriff's Office with the Gardier Initiative? From what I understand, it's been a long-lasting relationship that really does play a key factor into helping the youth here in the community. Well, I think you explained that very well. It, it, it does take multiple entities to, you know, impact the community the way we really want it to do. And I think the partnership that we have with the Gardner Initiative has been a very, very positive uh, role, and we couldn't have done anything without them. And Chad, we're standing here in one of the one of the rooms here at the Guardian Initiative. I mean, we showed a second ago. Brandon might be able to show again the bookshelf there behind us. I mean, there's some really but youth says books. She and, always and, and sees some sheriff's of the kids deputies that are patrolling in her neighborhood. You know, it, it, you look back, these kids were involved when they were that tall, and now they're here in their high school years. I mean, this has been a long-lasting bond. It has been, and, and my group and the sheriff's office in general, we, we've watched these kids grow up. Uh, we get invited to graduations and, and parties and things of that nature, and it's, and it's lo I love to, to go see these kids uh, be successful and, and, and move on with their lives. It's been very, very um, a good thing to see. Absolutely, and, and one more for you here. Um, the, the, the effort from the community perspective, um, in terms of the, the safety, trying to minimize the violence here at the youth level, do you know a certain number at the top of your head as to what the crime levels were looking like in the youth here over the course of this program going on over the last eight weeks? Uh, as far as I know, it's been it's been fairly quiet. I mean, you, you're, it's never going to be 100 percent, but but luckily with the with the Guardian Initiative being here and the kids having an outlet to come and and hopefully we've impacted them in some way that if they wanted to come talk to us, they could, or if they can talk to Miss uh, Dr. Harrison and them, they can come in and talk to them and and hopefully be able to help whatever issues that they have. So absolutely, Chad Parker here with East Baton Rouge Sheriff's Office, the Community Policing Department, and again. A lot of hands involved here, trying to keep uh, everyone safe, everyone happy, and, and help the youth, too, with doing great work here with the Guardian Initiative. Guys, with that, we'll send it back to you.